Hi, my name is Rebecca and I am the amphibian keeper at the Gladys Porter Zoo. We're going to be introducing you to a pretty cool amphibian from Central and South America, the Smoky Jungle Frog. Today, I'm going to be focusing on how this species of amphibians breed. Smoky Jungle Frogs mate during the rainy season, from May to November. Calling and breeding occur in the evenings at the edge of ponds and small streams. They maintain their territories by letting out loud, whoop-like calls that are repeated every 5 to 10 seconds. These calls used to challenge rival males and to attract females. During the breeding season, the male grows two sets of black spikes on his chest. He uses these spikes, a pair of spikes on his thumbs, and his muscular forearms to hold onto the female during implexus, which is the clasping posture of fertilization that occurs with frogs and toads. As they breed, the male kicks his hind legs to mix water, air, eggs, and slime to create a foamy nest. The female will deposit her 1,000 eggs into this mixture. Foam nests are usually constructed near streams, seasonal pools, or temporary puddles. The foam nest protects eggs from predators, bacteria, sunlight, and keeps them moist, which is useful since the nests are often laid on the ground instead of in the water. It also provides the embryo with all the oxygen it needs until it hatches. After they hatch, tadpoles will still remain in the foam nest throughout the entire month-long metamorphosis process. The nest keeps them safe and hydrated, and it can even be a meal when food is scarce. Thank you for watching and follow us on social media for upcoming videos.